walking to the subway about to um, take a little shopping stroll in the city. Well, not really in the city. It's in Barclays, if anybody know what that is. New York. But um, yeah, I need to update you guys. I've been on Dr. Oz. I was on there on Tuesday. And it was a, such an exciting experience. Like, I feel like when you're doing something that you're supposed to be doing, it just fit right in. So that was so exciting. If you're doing something you're supposed to do, it just feel like, yo, I'm made for this. Why doesn't it swipe? Let me try another one. I'm always having trouble with this thing. I hate this, yo. No, of course, I take no glory for that, though. Um, God got me through it all. I'm able to read Metro Card. <sighs> Why, though? Why is this always giving me trouble? Talking about it's not going to read it. <sighs> okay, whatever. And I have money on this. This makes no sense. Okay, so I'm back at work. I had to get a whole nother um, Metro card or whatever. So dumb. I had to put money on, money on it yesterday. But yeah, I was saying like I was on the Dr. Oz show or whatever. And it was so exciting. Like something that I, you know, would love to experience again as far as like being on TV and stuff. Like I'm made for this, yo. You know what I'm saying? Like when you find your purpose and... um finally do what you're supposed to do it just seemed like so at ease you know and i know god definitely opened the door but it took both of us you know um but actually it took me making the initiative you know because he's not going to do all the work you got to want it just as bad as he wanted for you so can you say that experience has made me like push harder like i've been um you know still doing my thing with pushing because i'm a go-getter so since i got here you know i've been doing my thing or whatever but it definitely pushed me harder and nothing wrong with um going harder than you was before my hair is all on my lip I hate that and now i got a cold it's so cold i was not ready for this new york weather yo i gotta get a scarf i need to get a new coat i need to get a hat but yeah but yo new york is lit i love it yo like i've always wanted to um you know move to new york or whatever and i'm finally here like <laughs> I can all I can definitely say God got me here and that's a fact. I'm from Virginia by the way. I'm going to go to this event or whatever. They looking for mentors and stuff to like mentor girls and all that. So I'm gonna check that out and see what that's about. I love the youth, I love kids. I used to work um, at a daycare center. I'm trying to um be back out on um, my way hopefully like the latest would be like 4 30 because the event is at 6 and then traffic starts like around 3 30 to 4. i can definitely say though like i was saying earlier when you definitely doing your purpose like everything seems like it's falling into place by no means it's going to be an easy road it's a journey and i have been i wouldn't say i've been so in love with the journey but um being on the journey definitely make you find yourself in who you truly are. And by not by all means, I'm not um, finished growing. Like I'm still going through through the phases or whatever. But I can definitely say I'm somebody that um, who I don't recognize. You know, I've been through a lot of my life. I'm 23, and it may seem like, well, girl, what you been through? <laughs> but I have. Here goes the train. About time. Ready. See you guys when I get there. Bye. So I made it on the train. I hope I'm going the right way to get out. Um, yep. So yeah. I mean, it's not a house, but I like to be machine. I look at 
I started a vlog in the past, well not a vlog, but a YouTube channel in the past. And um, I did like, I think like one video, but I wasn't consistent, so just let it go. Yeah, so I'm back though. Oh boy. I'm gonna be basically doing on my channel like, I'm gonna try to do like a vlog a week as far as like, my everyday life it depends like I haven't even thought about everything yet I'm a model so that's pretty exciting con exciting content to vlog also um I like to talk about you know experiences or help others do things or whatever but yeah I'm gonna be doing like some inspiration stuff you know I've heard though a lot of people don't like um motivational speaking because it's like <sighs> that people just inspire you and don't give you the steps to take oh god somebody just almost fell but yeah how I do how I'm gonna do it is like through my own experiences you know give encouragement words basically I'm in the Barclays Center W Apple I do not see on it. Yo, reason why I keep messing with my hair is because the wind is just real heavy and it's sticking to my lips. But yeah, like, just let me know in the comments, like, um, what you guys want to see. Yo, here's Old Navy. I'm lit, yo. Yay. So I just need to find a way to get through there, though. Okay, so here. Stop shop, old navy first floor. That's oh, look at me, just right there. And I won't even pay attention. Yeah, this is what I need. Some freaking scarves. Hi, everybody. So I'm at H and M now. Um, I went to old navy, as you know, and then I went to my shows. I got a couple of stuff. H&M though, they have some nice stuff. It's starting to rain outside, and I hate when it rains when I'm out and about. Hi everybody, so I just left out of H&M, got a couple of things, and now I'm crossing the street. I'm about to go in Burlington. You know the crazy thing is, I walk right past Burlington. You already know I said I didn't want to put on my GPS. Walk right past it. But it's like three something, so I'm still making good time, man. I gotta have some photo shoots that I'm supposed to be lined, having lined up. Man, I just been working like crazy. I ain't really have time, man. It's crazy because New York City is definitely like, you on the move. Grind, 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 grind. <laughs> definitely is. Gotta take that leap of faith to do what you, um, you know, you wanna do. Cause it's crazy because before I even moved here, I was, I was looking at YouTube to see, um, you know, like just about New York, like how much the metros cars, rent, and all of those things. And this was like literally like two to three weeks before I was able to move here. I'm about to just cross the street, but that's not wise. I can go. Thank you. Yes. Here comes the escalator that I hate. Hold on, y'all. But yeah, you gotta take that leap of faith to do what you wanna do. 
it ain't gonna be easy. Ain't no thing that you want in life is gonna be handed to you. I wanna know a quick funny story. When I was living in um Virginia, I was on the escalator, yo. I was on the wrong one, so the one that was going down, I was trying to go up on it. That jank was funny, and people was looking at me like, yo, what is she doing? And I'm like, why is people looking at me at the same time? <laughs> I'm like trying to speed up the steps and the jank going down. I was done. That's why I hate escalators. People just be stopping in the middle of the way. That's a size six. I wear a size seven, but boots typically run big. Take the wheel. Ooh, these are super cute. Oh my gosh. Let me check back in because I'm having a struggle with my bags and this stuff. All right, bye. Hello, everyone. So I'm back. I just went to um get my Jamaican food. I got back from the um stores later than what I thought, yo, and it was traffic just like I didn't want it to be. Which is okay, I'm not in a rush, but it's like an hour before I have to go to my um, event. But yeah, um, I'm ready to see what this event is about. Um, Cause I love, you know, just the simple fact of um, helping people and, um, you know, giving advice. Everybody always, even with me being in um, high school always, I was always that friend that everybody came to, you know, get advice or just event to starting my youtube channel i want to do you know different sit downs and talk about different topics and give my um you know basically i wouldn't say my opinion but basically factual information based upon what i've been through in my life you know to help others because you don't go through anything just for you you know your life is bigger than you you know don't get me wrong you got to take care of yourself you have to do that but at the same time you know your story is to help other people because some people don't know how to get through what they go through or some people just don't have nobody to help them you know so why not <laughs> why not checking in from yesterday basically um the event was a success man like i wasn't expecting to get a um a minty so quick but it was a little girl there and basically like she really clung to me and um just got attached to me just at the event and she was like mom can't you please be my mentor kids is like my heart you know and any way to give advice or just to be there to help somebody else and to pair them along their path is something that i wanted to um but yeah i'm so excited to what's to come um like i said i wasn't expecting that but i already have a mentee um the people that was there i'm not sure that they get paired up with a mentor i mean not a mentor but a mentee already um but yeah i already have mine so i'm gonna close out this vlog just to say you know to keep the journey going because you never know like it didn't always start out for me like this you know i had to get here and really prepare myself and prepare my mind my body my soul everything had to be in alignment for things to you know play its part so I know that i'm going to be starting my channel with inspiration videos and motivation and things like that so i gotta go though so y'all have a good one bye all I know is coming when it's to the summer. Work on top of work, you know we 